Waking up about 10, 10 15, just getting up, a little bit of a stretch, just a little bit of cereal. Shower, changed, get in the car, you know, bit of music here and there, just gear myself up, driving to, to the stadium. I think just to get geared up, I've been listening to a lot of Migos, so you know, their, their beats and stuff, and just feel like pumped and, and ready to go. Uh, park up at the stadium, walk through obviously the tunnels and stuff, get changed just into the little training kit, uh, go upstairs and have pre match with all the boys bit of pre-match, bit of scrambled eggs, pasta, and just chilling out for an hour, relaxing, sort of trying to get into the into the mind frame of the game. Be chilling with Stu, Ryan, Virgil, Charlie, you know, just be just be chatting, you know, we'll have the maybe the early kickoff on in the in the in the pre-match meal room. Just everyone's quite calm and relaxed and just sort of anticipating when ready for the game. So we have like a little pre-activation room in the change room as well, so when we're doing that, Manager comes in and you know he's talking his pieces and, and you know Virgil's a big voice in the dressing room, Stephen Davis, Ryan Bertrand, Charlie Austin, you know, there's a lot of senior players in there that will that will share their share their piece and you know try and get the boys geared up. Obviously I always tie my laces a certain way, I always put my shin pads on from right to left first. Um, the only thing I do is obviously put my shirt on my lap with my name facing upwards. Um, and obviously I always pray before every game anyway, so in the tunnel putting the jackets on. Usually I'm standing in front of Duzan Tadic, so I'm second last out. And Duzan's always saying, you know, he's behind me pumping himself up or he's, you know, smacking me as hard as he can on my shoulders. Like, I hate it sometimes, but he's, I know he's trying to gear himself up and gear me up. So um, before you're walking out, it's, especially at St Mary's, it's nice to see it all full. And you know, all the fans have got the clappers and it's loud. It's just like, sort of just exhale and you're like, right, it's game day. It's what you sort of dreamed of doing your whole life.